I made a list of things last year of, of things not to cry about. Yeah. And one of them, the schedule was near the top of that list. I mean, there's nothing you can do. That you're going to play who you play. Yeah. But just exactly like you're saying, and we may have had this conversation before, you know, if, if you're, no matter how much we improved uh, with our schedule, starting from where we started from, and we might have improved tenfold, but the schedule we had, you wouldn't see improvement because of who we were playing. But I would have would have been nice to come in and, and get four or five wins out of those first six games based on the teams we were playing. That was the plan. That was the goal. Yeah. That, that's what we want to do. We didn't go in any game just to throw our hands up and say, well, it was nice being here. We just have a lot of seniors that know what they're doing. And um, we have a lot of young guys, too. And I think we just really try hard every day, you know. We uh, push each other. There's no days off with the linebacker group. So um, really, we push the whole defense to be better. We're all leaders on here, so yeah. I think about like how much experience we have. Me and him, we've been playing varsity, starting on varsity since 10th grade. So it's like it's like it's all coming full circle now. Cause now, even though and even though we had so many changes happen since we've been here, it's like we all we gain something from every change that we can bring into our senior season. I mean, COVID didn't make it any better, but it helped us like be able to learn a playbook more. So now we moving at a faster rate to where we can just come out here and just ball. Of course, football not our whole life, but it's something we depend on. Um, football took a, it's taking us places we never thought we would go.